We've got gruesome new details in a high profile murder that the I team has been following for six years. So we rewind the clock. May 2016, well known Dallas attorney Ira Tabalowski was found burned to death inside his own garage. The I team's Ginger Allen has followed the case since day one and has today's developments. Six years after the murder of prominent Dallas attorney Ira Tabalowski, Stephen Aubrey has been indicted. The then Texas man was involved in a defamation lawsuit with Tabalowski at the time of the murder. In just released court documents, Dallas police detective Brian Fillingham alleges Aubrey spied on Tabalowski through a hole in his fence, which Tabalowski's son showed us years ago to, quote, learn his daily routine. The detective says Aubrey waited for the attorney to enter his garage, doused him with gasoline, and then set him on fire with a torch. The documents state detectives noticed a healing burn of some kind on Aubrey's hands and lower arm days after the murder. Police say they also found propane torches and clothing with ignitable liquid residue inside Aubrey's apartment. They say they also discovered electronic devices with Google map searches for Tabalowski's home, synagogue, and the words burner phone and alibi definition. The detective says Aubrey reached out to an associate the night of the murder, asking in an email for legal advice about dealing with the detectives. Court records indicate the associate replied, you took it to a whole new level when you had done thrown gas on, followed by a string of expletives. The associate then allegedly writes, don't kill anyone again. We know this yes. is the person. In their only interview after Aubrey's arrest, the Tabalowski family wanted to thank Detective Fillingham. Hours ago, they told me the newly released documents only scratch the surface of what will come out in trial. The I-team has reached out to Aubrey's attorney several times, but he has not responded. Ginger Allen, CBS 11 News. Stephen Aubrey still in Florida where he is fighting extradition.